Assalamu alaikum and greetings. Alishan Mo here. Today we are going to review the LCD 5802D from Ishin. It's a 7 inch LCD screen with built in DVR and built in 40 channel race band diversity 5.8 GHz receivers. Previously, I have reviewed an Ishin 7 inch LCD which was a similar LCD and I was simply loving that for its performance. And the only thing missing from that LCD was a DVR and a race band 40 channel 5.8 GSZ diversity receiver. So this time Ishin has actually upgraded and improved the LCD they have. This is LCD 5802D, remember the number, and it comes with built-in DVR and race band 40 channel 5.8 GSZ diversity receivers. The remaining spe specs, uh, it has a dual buffered AV outputs. It can receive two different channels at the same time. I didn't know it could do that. It's not affected by 2.4 GHz RC radios. Uh, it is a small, lightweight and durable. Durable? Well, don't try to test this durability by dropping it. I wouldn't do that. Uh, it, is a, it has a built-in battery and that uh, gives you enough time, actually enough operating time, not very satisfactory, enough operating time. Uh, it's easy to carry, easy to store, yeah, easy to store, of course. Uh, they have given you a bag like that, so it's very, very easy to store everything inside. And it, is, it has a one key auto search uh, channels, or oh, sorry, signals. So instead of pressing channels and trying to match the frequency that you want to receive for the video signals, you just press the search button and it will search automatically. And of course it has a work status OSD for, for you to see if your LCD screen is working properly. So this is how I keep it in the bag. So let me just take it out and we will call it an unboxing as well. So you have an Ishin LCD, alright. You have been given uh, two antennas, well, um, not the Fat Shark Immersion RC Mushroom antenna. Well, this is mine. You will be given two of these uh, Omni antennas, okay? And um, of course, you have a user manual. Then it has an AV in cable, that audio video cable, so you can actually uh, give the input to the LCD from an external source. And it has the battery cable so that you can use an external LiPo battery to charge LCD battery, which is mm, very, very nice. So basically, you can even charge it outdoors using any LiPo batteries. And if I dig in more inside, we have a cleaning clothes, all right? And don't forget this nice carrying case. Now, what missing is the battery charger. So the LCD charger is just like that. It has an out, uh, wall outlet adapter, okay? So you can easily charge the LCD at home. Now, let me put on the antennas so you can see how the LCD looks and then I'll give you a closer looky looky at, at this LCD screen. I used it recently to fly my MTD and also I used it to uh, drive my, um, you know, this Axial FPV uh, driving truck, okay? So here it is, the Ishin. 7 inch LCD with race band 40 channel diversity 5.8 GHz receivers. It has a very nice shade, built in battery, and a DVR. So don't forget that it has a DVR so you can record your flights right away. Remember, DVR is very, very useful in case if something unfortunate happens, you crash your aircraft. You will always know your last location by playing the video back from the DVR and you will know where, what was the last location your aircraft went down. So previously I had a crash and I was running a DVR, it was easier for me to find my quadcopter. So here it is. So here it is how it looks, okay, from all angles. This is the Asian 7 inch new DVR LCD, right? All right, so here's a closer look for you. We have an on off switch, okay, record and picture button. If you press this button one time, you will record a picture. I mean, your DVR will record the screenshot. And if you keep uh, press and hold it, you will start recording the video and press it once again to stop recording the video. 
Okay, next we have the search button. This is where you will press and search for your signals. Then you have a menu and screen button. Then you have plus channel or band plus. So you can manually select bands and channels. You also have a battery status indicator. Then you have A and B receiving uh, indicators. Uh, channel A and channel B, that is a diversity built-in receiver in it. So so you can easily see which receiver is actually at the moment receiving uh, the video signals. Okay, at this side you have nothing, alright. On the top you have two antennas. On the back you have a speaker, yes it has a volume, it can give you volume if it is coming from your video transmitter, okay. And you can also fix it on a tripod. And the interesting thing is at the right side. So at the right side you have DC vol 12 volt in, then you have AV in, you have TF card slot for your DVR and you have AV out should you want to take an AV out from here and feed it to goggles or other LCDs you also have an AV out. Alright, so now let me turn on the LCD and turn on the FPV system and we'll see how it's working. Okay, time to have a little bit of fun so you can see how the LCD and DVR are working. I have my Futaba 4 PLS system here in my hands and my uh, Axial Wraith is ready for FPV. Let me take the cap off from the camera and get the truck ready, okay? Okay, turn on the LCD. Sometimes it is just uh, lucky you get the signals right away. Okay, nothing, so we will press search. You will see my foot actually, because my foot or my leg is right in front of the camera. Almost there. There. All right. Please insert card. That was a message from my camera because I don't have a TF card in that. All right. That's my beautiful foot. Okay. So this is a much better angle for you to view. I will start recording. All right. You see a little red dot appears there. This means you have started recording. Uh, excuse my uh, beautiful feet right in front of the uh, camera. And we will go and drive around. Let's go to our bedroom and hope there is there are no private parts or stuff there. <laughs> parts, come on man. Alright, inside, under the bed, there is no boo-boo under the bed. Let's check nicely, okay. No boo-boo under the bed, let's go out. Signals are breaking, signals are breaking, uh, but we have enough for now to go around. Okay, clear signal, go left. Let's do some climbing on these. Oh, I was about to roll. Okay, mattress climbing was nice. This side I will lose the signals big time, so we will go straight and if we lose the signal, we will come back straight. Losing it, losing it, losing it. Go back, go back, come back. All right, we got the signal back. Try to go here. Come on, get the signals back. There are lots of boxes. Well, yes, these are lots and lots of boxes. They just arrived. These belong to my sister because she is moving from UK to Dubai. Yay, my sister is here. After a long time, I can actually be meeting her quite often, inshallah. So this is, yes, happy times for uh, the family is gathering here in UAE. Alright, so let's come back. This is enough driving and enough test for the DVR. Back to my beautiful feet. Alright, let, uh, let me turn the recording off. Okay, a lock appears and it will disappear. That means you have recorded your uh, DVR footage. Alrighty, that was a nice drive at home. Now, what I will do now is uh, go to menu. We'll take a closer look at the menu very, very quickly. Okay, here we are. If you are looking at the menu, we have uh, DVR, brightness, Contrast, color, sharpness, rotation, volume, power off, language. Okay, that's it. That's all the menu. In DVR, you only get play or delete the file or select the next file. 
So that is it for the Ishin LCD, a 7 inch LCD with built in DVR. This is a lightweight, easy to carry and a good looking LCD. Comparatively to the goggles, it's not that good, but compar comparing to other LCD screens, I find the Ishin 7 inch LCDs has a very, very good reception. So yes, that's why I like the Ishin LCDs because they have a built in diversity receiver and now we have a DVR as well. All right, thank you very much for watching the Ishin LCD review. It is available at banggood.com. I got it from the banggood.com. Enjoy and more videos are coming very, very soon. Hey, thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe to my channel and stay updated for all the coolest and regular RC videos, RC shows, RC reviews, time-lapse videos, and much more. Thank you very much for all your support. More videos are coming. I got it. Eat this pot, maybe. <laughs>